This is the instruction video for iPhone screen replacement. Replacing your screen is not a difficult task, but you must be careful not to damage your phone or screen due to installation errors. Please turn off the phone before proceeding to any of the installation steps. Use the pentalobe screwdriver to remove the two screws adjacent to the charge port. Use the magnetic pad included to keep track of all screws and their locations. Apply the suction cup on the bottom of the screen. Insert the guitar pick right near the charging port. Once you see the gap at the bottom, use the opening tool and the spudger to split under and then using a twisting motion to slowly go deeper around the phone to separate the adhesive. Open the display to about a 90 degree angle. Unscrew these screws on the metal plate with the screwdriver. Then, remove the metal plate. Screw types and lengths may vary. Use the magnetic pad included to keep track of all screws and their locations. Disconnect the ribbon cables by sliding a spudger underneath them and prying it up from its socket on the logic board. To avoid a short circuit, disconnect your iPhone charging cable before you begin repairing your screen. This will also ensure that you do not accidentally switch on the device during repair. Then gently remove the display assembly. The next part is removing the front panel assembly on the top. Start off with removing these screws that hold down the top piece. Pull out the earpiece from underneath the cables, then you can lift out the proximity sensor from their little brackets Install the components. Take your little plastic holders and install it into the new screen. You don't need to glue them in, you just need to put it back into place carefully. Please be careful when putting back these ribbon cables. Make sure all of them are put on the right place. Tuck them back into the little plastic brackets. Push them down into place so that they are flush with the iPhone. Then, get all the screws down into the bracket and make sure it doesn't come loose. Hold the replacement screen up at a 90 degree angle to the frame, then gently connect the ribbon cables to the logic board. Use your finger to gently push the connectors into place. You will hear a clear click when you snapped it into each connect. The battery should be the last thing to connect. Put back the metal plate over the connects, install all screws back with the screwdriver.
Then, starting from the top, lay the screen back into the frame, making sure the edge clips don't get bent. You need to power on your phone and inspect the following functions before installation. Once everything works, power off the device, insert the two screws on the bottom of the phone with the pentalope screwdriver, then close the phone.